My father died of cancer 11 years ago. Um, he was diagnosed with liver cancer and he survived less than six months after his diagnosis. We hoped that that would be the only time that cancer would hit our family. Uh, unfortunately, that was not the case. In July of 2016, I was diagnosed with a blood cancer known as multiple myeloma. And it's a disease that starts in your bone marrow, it uh, attacks your liver, and attacks your bones. My first thought went to, how do I tell my family? And how do I tell my wife? How do I tell my kids? And I was pleasantly surprised that people are stronger than you think and, and they pitch in and they help with these things. So it went better than I could have expected. And then the second thing that I thought about was how I want to live my life. Uh, I didn't want cancer to uh, rule the day. I started chemo uh, therapy uh, right away and I've had um, treatment twice a week. Uh, even during last season, through my college football season, uh, chemo treatments on Mondays and Tuesdays, and then get on a plane on Thursday and, and get to do college football, which is one of the things I love to do. Currently, there is no cure for multiple myeloma, but in the last few years, uh, research has provided a number of treatments that help patients like myself. And it's organizations like the V Foundation that support that research and give cancer patients like me hope. So I hope you support the V Foundation and all the work that it's doing to fight against cancer.